Right, we're leaving here, aren't we? Yeah. Hans Camping, Bremen. And we're following Sue, because Sue seems to have a better route than... Well, it's, it's, it seems to be a shorter route, doesn't it? Yeah. So we're off to Humans Boss. Yes, in the Netherlands. In the Netherlands. That's a second to last stop, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. No, it's, it's funny, as Sue was saying last night, the, um, on a tour, it always seems like the last few sites go quicker than the first sites. Mm. Not sure what this uh, next site's going to be like. But, no. Uh, I think we've actually booked a six amp hookup, haven't we? <laughs> we have. <laughs> Which is, I always think is <laughs> almost pointless. Turning around that van. In one and a half kilometres, oh. keep right toward A27. Keep yeah. right toward A27 in 400 metres. Be in the left lane, then keep Here we left go. onto B6. Well, oh, see. It's weird, but. Keep left toward A found set. This one. Oh no. Go around another loop in a minute. sat and having a panic in a minute. Well, hopefully she might change the route to the same. Yeah. Yeah, she's recalculating. Sorry? She's recalculating. Yep. Here we are. Yep. The Netherlands. people off over there. Germany's introduced um, random border checks, haven't they? Yeah. Yeah, that's on the Netherlands side there. Yeah, but it's going into Germany. Yeah. Look at the chaos it's causing. Yeah. Be in either of the two right lanes, then take the exit to A1. So we're having a little stop off. We're going to go to Arnhem. We're going to have a look at the John Frost Bridge, maybe, and possibly the museum there. All the way to the campsite, so it's not too far away. Take the exit on the right to A15, then keep left. Keep left here. Be in either of the two left lanes. Sorry? No, it's OK. It's all right. Here is 162. It's one um, 
179 on the motorway. Turn right onto Western Middle Sedanic. In one and a half kilometers, arrive at Western Middle Sedanic 81 on the left. Right, so I'm just going to jump in here. Um, I wanted to show and share this bit of footage. I've been editing the, the video and we got really stressed this day and I um, wanted to show it really because it, it, it's real life and uh, these things happen and things go wrong. What happened here was that Trev and Sue were taking us to a camping platz and you've got a picture of it which we'll put on the screen now. Yes, yeah, yeah camping platz Arnhem. We assumed we could park there. <laughs> yeah, uh, and of course when we got there uh, we, there were a load of cars there, um, there seemed to be some work going on, there was uh, a load of trucks there Yes. and uh, in the end we really couldn't park there. No, Sue got out and asked a lorry driver, didn't she, is this, can you park a camper here and he said he didn't know. He didn't know, no. So um, We didn't know why there were so many trucks there that's either, right, that's, no. the, that's the other thing. No, so we thought well there's not really no space here. Um, we better move on. So we thought we knew where we'd parked here before. So yeah, this yeah. is us taking over and now Trev and Sue are following us. We've put Google Maps on by now. Yes, because we thought with road closures and things like that, Google Maps would take us to the place. So we were now aiming for somewhere called Parker Platz Reinkard. Okay. Which I'll put a map up where that was. Yeah. Um, and so off we go. Yeah, so like I say, we're following Google Maps, so we'll let Google Maps go here. And uh, it seemed fairly straightforward where we were going. Yeah, that's right. Well, it seemed to be we'd go straight along this road. Eventually we would see the John Frost Bridge. Yeah. And then we would remember a bit of when we've visited here before. Yeah. But. <laughs> there was a big but coming. Yeah. Yeah. So off we went. We completely forgot to switch a GoPro. <laughs> it wasn't yeah. a deliberate. We yeah. just hadn't switched it back on. So no. fortunately we got a dash cam. So that was recording some of the footage. Yeah. Across a lot of red traffic lights. Yeah, didn't we? Uh, what, we were moaning about all the traffic lights being red all the time, <laughs> which they were. But I started. I started to recognise some of the places that we'd been, but it was it There was, was the John Frost Bridge, ago. we could see the John Frost yes, Bridge. Yes, and we'd been over that the last time we came. We'd walked over it, hadn't we? You had walked over it, so yeah. we're I'll still going towards the centre, yeah. still following Google Maps, who's trying to take us to this parking place. All Again, red another red, red traffic, traffic light. light, yeah. Yeah, so we thought, oh, we, we know where we're going. Yeah, we we'll remember this. I think part of our problem was when we originally came, we approached it from a different direction. From the other side. From the other side. So yeah. therefore things didn't quite this come to mind. This is where a bit confused because there's a big roundabout here, but people were going left there. Yes. And I think we should have probably gone left there. She was saying go left at various times, wasn't she? Yeah, but we ended up going around this roundabout. Because yes. More, more red traffic lights. Now I think she was saying here, go left here. And that's probably where we should have gone. Yeah. We should, which we did. Yeah. We did. You'll see in a minute. Well, we did go left to here. Yeah. We? Yeah. I think at this stage, Google Maps seemed to have stopped talking to us. Yeah. Don't really know why it stopped communicating with us, but uh, we sat at these traffic lights for ages, wondering what the hell was going on and where to go and. I think Sue was on WhatsApp yeah. saying where we're going, what's going well, on. We and didn't know where we were going. N we didn't know where we were going. And I think we should have turned left here as well. Yeah, but some some reason we carried on. Because we would then come across the bridge. I thought, oh, recognise this. And I was arguing with you and uh, saying we're on the right side of the bridge. And you were, you were saying, saying we're no, no, we're not. We should be. Because Google Maps was actually saying we'd arrived. Yeah, because well, in, a, in a minute, is. I think it actually says you have arrived at your destination. Yeah. No, I think it says here you've arrived at your destination. The destination is actually underneath us. The bridge is underneath the bridge. Yeah. 
and we've missed two left turns yeah. to help us get down there. Yeah, so we're heading to the other side of the bridge now and starting to panic. Yeah, because we're thinking, how do we get back? How do we get back to? Because we remembered parking along the river down there and we remembered the parking place. Thinking this is this is wrong. We shouldn't. We, we only walked over this bridge. We never. Yeah, we never actually drove walked over. on the left hand side here for a short while. There's like a cycle. There's like a cycleway, and we got run over by some scooters. So anyway, we we the bridge naturally takes you off to the left anyway. But we went off to the right because we were sort of trying to turn ourselves round. So we thought, and have oh, another go at yeah. uh, getting along there. So my idea now, and I'm not listening to Google Maps at all now by now, and I'm on complete autopilot panic mode. Yeah. I'm turning right now to get underneath the bridge, if you see what I mean. Yes, yeah, to take us back on ourselves. Yeah. That's what we thought. But because if you look overhead, we've got some... Uh, well, it's... Uh, but then we've been in other places we've been, where yeah. we've had overhead cables we're not, like this. No, we're not in trouble at the moment. No, no. I think we're all right at this stage. We're, we're going along this road for a while. But the road gradually got narrower. But still, notice there's still overhead pylons here. Again, that's not unusual. No, we've even had those on the motorway, haven't we? One of the motorways in Germany had them. That's right. And we got to this junction, and there's no signs here, don't turn right, don't go right. You can see, there was, it was a cycleway, I was waiting for the pedestrian and the, and the scooterist to go by. So I'm going right here. Still no signs. Still same. no signs, but there's a lot of overheads now. Yeah, we noticed so we there stop are more. Here. There's the other bridge, I think it's called Nelson Mandela Bridge. Okay. So, well that's going to take us back over the river, you see, so because we think... This yeah. is where we're crossing over, and I can see just to the right of us, there's a load of building work going on. Yes, and this is where we think the parking areas were. Now this is where I was really stressed out, and uh, I've, I've taken the sound out of this. Um, I don't normally swear, but I was swearing here. <laughs> yeah, and uh, I mean, I'll put another picture up. You can see with the uh, bridge that we went over in the bus lane, that the bus lane is on the right hand side of that bridge yeah so somehow we needed to get onto that bridge and clue might have been in that car that turned left maybe you, you should have turned left to get onto the bridge to get over the road over the river i don't know i don't know but it was it was very scary yeah so uh, moral of the story is know where you're going before you set off yes yeah uh, and i also think some of these towns that we're we're not used to towns or cities. We're far safer going on the bus or going on the train yeah, if we can. Yeah. There's Trevon, so yeah, yeah, that, they they it, managed to they get out, out that it. way. Yeah. yeah. So yeah, hands up. I made a big mistake here, or oh, several big mistakes. I think. Well, we, we both did, didn't we? It's yeah. just uh, yeah. And, just one yeah of the... and people are going to say, yeah, you should have used a map. Yes, we could have used a map, but Jenny was on. Had the the um, the phone. Not the phone, the um, sat nav had fallen off its mount. That's right, that happened as well, didn't that it? So I'm trying to hold that. Yeah, so you were trying to hold the phone. Yeah. And uh, she was looking at the phone. I couldn't see the phone. No, no. <laughs> we sh should have put it on the Google Maps on the on the van, but it didn't do that either. No, because we were we were struggling for data. You see, the trouble with Google Maps on your phone is it needs mobile data. And because mine was nearly run out, you were, you were, would have reliant on the routers weren't you because yeah. you hadn't got any phone and i couldn't data. connect to the router because that hadn't got any data no that's right <laughs> so yeah. you know it, so it the was... whole sort of thing all conspired to uh so but it might have been we would love to have gone there and we should really have found out if we could go on the bus but again we didn't really have time because we were rushing around yeah and i'm going to stop it there so we've given up on the idea of visiting arnhem turned into a bit of a disaster we didn't think I think my brain was about to blow a fuse yeah, I think so yeah
Trev's got his right. reversing lights on. For a code we need or something? I don't think so. I don't think there's a code. There's only one toilet block open at the moment. Right. Again, we're out of season. Yeah. Which is, uh, has its advantages, isn't it? Hmm, there's probably no one else here. No. <laughs> there's table football over there. Table football? He said there's lots of nice places to cycle and walk. In here. <laughs> Probably not mine. Yeah. Right. Years of practice, haven't they? And all the vans here are all right hand drive. I think they put the Brits together. Oops, some trees above us a little bit it's not hopefully it's not too bad but one of them is an is a oak tree so a little bit worried about well for poppy she does worry when things fall on the roof the um, electrics are interesting <laughs> covered in green mm, that's the fuse board couple of horrors in there. I'll leave it for the electricians to sort out. Perhaps we'll get Glenn in and tidy it up. Yeah, particularly like this bit here. I suppose that's okay, it's an earth, isn't it? But oh, I don't know. Right, am I off on my bike? I'm gonna have a little look around the campsite. See what I can see. Ah, first thing is no time service point. Can have a look at that. Ah yes, okay. A typical continental motorhome service point. <laughs> Great big long hose there. Toilet block behind us here. Okay. It's 
Dorplas Chemish Toilet. Okay. It's all good. It smells clean in there. It smells like it's got disinfectant. Oh, that's for, the, that's for the showers, right, okay, yeah, so you put your money in there and go in the shower with the corresponding number. Okay, got it. Wash basins. Yeah, the showers themselves look nice and clean. Three wash basins each side. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. looks very well kept. Oops. There's a family room here by the looks of it. Oh yeah, okay. I mean, it's so quiet this time of year. Down here. Oh, there's a play area here, table tennis. That's the other shower block that's closed. Some more statics around here. And they call these bungalows, these ones. Cream van there. Bizarre. Yeah, more mobile homes and bungalows. Okay. Okay. Playground there. reception area in a minute. There's more little touring pictures here. Yeah. And here. And what are these? Huh? A water point. Somewhere to fill your bucket up with or something like that. Yeah, so obviously another, someone to wash your dishes there. Not sure what's here. Looks like a rally field. Okay. Some sort of hut to go in. It's a bit cool, it's quite warm today, yeah, this afternoon. It certainly heated up from earlier, it was about 16. This is an unusual sight, isn't it? I didn't really notice that as I came past. Giant windmill. Swimming pool's closed. Playground to the right. Bins here. Yes? 
Do what? I've got the coins so you can have a share. All right. 50 Excellent. Cents a 50, 50, 50 cents. Cents. Sorry, so you have okay. to make note of what number shower you are. That's it. I've been, I have been in there, sir. <laughs> <laughs> Work that out. Did you check when the restaurant opens? Oh, no, I didn't. Let's have a look. Yeah, it looks like it's closed. Well, there's a tap inside the showers. Oh, what? Is that for you to get your fresh water? There's a tap with a grid. I don't, I don't know. Inside inside I've seen a few the of them. Maybe that's where you get. Uh, yeah, maybe that's what it's for. Motorhome service point. It's only there, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. So, yeah. I it mean, doesn't say drinking water on it, but it's a tap. No, but you've got somewhere to put a container, haven't you? Yeah. There's a grid underneath it, isn't there? So these are... Seems... Times. Day, is it? So there's... That must be Tuesday. Gessler tennis, that's shut. Gesloten, yeah. Shut, Wednesday. Yeah, yeah. Donderdag. Not open until Thursday. Thursday. Oh, oh that's... Good. good choice, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> Oh well. Oh we uh, well. So do it yourself meal tonight then? Yeah. Yeah, there is a snack bar here as well, but I think that's the uh, same opening times as the uh, as the restaurant. It's very quiet here. There's pluses and minuses coming this time of year. I mean Pluses are that the weather's still good. It's still warm, a bit cool at night sometimes. But uh, certainly on the continent, things tend to close down towards the end of September. I wonder how I get to that windmill. Windmill feet route and uh, windmill and okay. Well, what I can get from my limited Dutch there is that there's a there's a wind molen feet route, so a cycle route for looking at windmills. Yeah, so we're going out for a little bike ride. What's the name, Veg? Yeah. There's a nice little cycle track along here. So. Okay. It's a little bit off-road, not too bad, but a bit muddy. Over the river, or is it a canal? I think it's a canal, isn't it? Yeah, so this is the nearest town, Malden. Oh, we're thinking Malden in Essex. Right. <sighs> In Nijmegen. And Nijmegen's the 
oldest town in the Netherlands. I think this must be the university. Yeah, definitely the place of bikes and scooters anyway. Oh, I'm by the train station there. Yeah. Yeah, oh yeah. Let's get far into the hospital. Eyes in the back of your head here, aren't you? I was thinking about a coffee, I think. No? I oh, know, just following the sat nav. Ooh. There's the bridge. I think that's it. Watch, watch, watch. What am I looking at? Oh, that, right, I'm going to look. Let's have a look at the bridge then, we'll come back, yeah? Maybe we'll go around the block. Yeah. You could go left and, and then go right. Yeah. I'll go to the left. Okay. Of course, it's the 40th anniversary of. Uh, Operation Market Garden, so they're going to see quite a few military vehicles around. It's quite oh, yeah. iconic, isn't it? Yeah. Oh. Trev, just wait a minute. There's boats over here. Sailing ships. Oh. And my sister would like to do one of these boats. Yeah. Your own balcony there. Eh? Back onto the cobbles. I've gone for a baba ganoush. <laughs> and some meatball sandwich by the looks of it. The houses have got a nice view, haven't they? Yeah. Don't forget to take the lens cap off. No, that's always a good idea. It's uh, 
a little bit of scaffold in there, aren't they? Yeah. Mm. They're ornate. Ooh, and everything here. Wow. Stephen's Kirk. Pedals up here. For that. Yeah. <laughs> wow. Yeah. These paintings here, obviously covering up the uh, scaffolding work. Yeah. Uh, so yeah, the detail in the these little statues here. Bartholomew, Matthias. Jacobus, Andreas, Paulus, Petrus. I know. Yeah. Yeah. Gotta love the uh, cafe life. <laughs> when it when the weather's like this. Yeah. Sitting yeah. out there. I mean, you could, we could spend all afternoon here. Couldn't yeah. We? Easily. I think the girls would love it too. Yeah. It's, it's a little bit of eep. Yeah. In a funny sort of way. Yeah, yeah. You know, it's got that to... Yeah. We'll make the way back. Yeah. We've still got 40 minutes. Or so, so I'm going out. Yeah. yeah. I'll get lost again. I'll have a way the water runs down there. Oh, yeah. Nice, a little bit of modern art here. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> it's interesting. I don't know what's going on there. <laughs> Urban summer. Yeah, this is a cafe we went into. Stephen, it's called. But, uh, heading back to the bikes now. I think we'll be able to spot ours. We left it at the end somewhere, makes it a bit easier. There we are. Back over the canal. Back at the site. Well, oh, we go this way. Oh, yeah, 
motorhome service point and to reverse into it a little bit tight getting in here so once you're in here it's alright don't know if that's meant for fresh water but we wouldn't fancy using that I tried pressing the button nothing coming out of it okay. I was saying last year that was all scaffolding around this yeah. Trip. And it looks yeah. absolutely beautiful now. Yeah. Yeah, wonderful. 